Students spent today rallying in support of teachers. Now, the teachers could vote to strike tomorrow. As WBZ's Anna Myler shows us, those teachers have been working without a contract this entire school year so far. Dozens of parents bundled up and braved the below freezing temperatures to hold a rally in front of Newton City Hall in support of their kids' teachers. They're way underpaid. I mean, that's really the bottom line. They've been underpaid for years and years and years. Newton teachers have been working without a contract since the start of the school year. They're asking for cost of living increases, among other things. And we wanted to send a clear message that the parents also want a fair contract for our teachers. So we took time out of our days to come here to the city hall to show the mayor and the school committee that, that we support our teachers. The union president penned an open letter to the superintendent and school committee writing in part, the real issue is that you continue to look for a cheap contract from us in order to solve your primary problem. Mayor Fuller has chronically underfunded the schools. After the rally today, the mayor invited a group of parents into City Hall to meet and responded to complaints of the schools being underfunded. Uh, I look forward to getting back Back to our voters and asking for an operating override uh, proposition two and a half caps all of our uh, tax revenue and if we I believe in our children and in our teachers and our schools and if we want to increase the funding for the Newton Public Schools we'll have to convince our voters to do so. In a statement released this morning, the Newton School Committee chair wrote in part, we will do everything we can to reach a competitive agreement that both honors our educators and provides program improvements and necessary supports for our students. We call on the NTA to return to mediation so that students can stay in school. If the union does vote to go on strike, school will be closed and extracurricular activities will be canceled. The union could also possibly face fines as teacher strikes are illegal in Massachusetts. In Newton, Anna Myler, WBZ News.